probably do like a rope trader all day tomorrow. Uh, follow that, select that. We're going to go forward. Bring out the other one as well in a second. So what we'll do is we'll take these two. Pull them forward a bit. Pop them on the front of the F R two so that you can pop them straight into the sawmill. that over upper into reverse done we're taking you and we're taking you i opened up the coupler before i did that that's uh not good but we'll uh close them can't open that one now so that's unfortunate oh your handbrake is on as well okay, it's always the front too so if we need to turn on yours the other group. There we go. Let's pull that line out. For two orders, guard, move forward a little bit. Stop you there. Disconnect them first, uncouple. Throw that on. There's a line switched against you. It doesn't matter. Thought you were in yard mode. No, not you. Huh. Ah, yeah. I thought in yard mode he'd go through that. Putting him in uh, manual mode anyway. Back up to 78% condition, which is nice. Get a tiny derailment. Just a tiny one.
connect that up, turn off that handbrake, pop you into reverse. Oh, I turned on that handbrake. Let's go. Wait, he's looking. Oh, you're a couple. Get out of there. Switch that back. We're going to go to you. Orders. Card. Reverse. And car lengths. What are you doing? I'm gonna go past this switch. Stop the train. Bumper into reverse. Alright, should be good to go. There's another five car lengths. We're giving orders to that one through this panel and then we're controlling this one through this panel. Which I need to break. Switch that. And then that's right. Oh, yeah, you went into that one, that's fine. In, and he's in. That's all we wanted to do there. $106 just for that. We haven't even left our yard, realistically. And then we're going to grab the and send him up to, uh, to the other run. You know, I probably will do Rogue Trader later, but I'll probably like, uh, do another hour or two of this and then take a break. do the thing with the thing and do this for you. And we're going to do this. 
orders. That's all good. So it should be road forward. Go to 15, and he should stop for the fusey. Then we pop back over to you. Select you. And orders, manual. Holofield, Hitting Isle is... Oh, that's in Whittier. That's in Ella. So actually, stop. Do something completely different here. Yeah. Bring the passenger car. As we should. We didn't clear it enough. Just play that much. Oh man. Six thirty in the morning. We're allowed to mess around a bit, right? another thing. okay it stopped for the those anyway that's fine hey Mitsos, how you doing choo choo indeed a new game yeah this is railroader it came out into early access was it yesterday or the day before um, i only found out about it like a little bit before it came out i'm kind of looking forward to it a lot of fun we've already done four hours today It's a shame that it came out at the same time as Rogue Trader. Because I've been really looking forward to that too. Boom. Connected. We can release that. Right. Before we do anything else with the U. Well, actually, we can... I want to do that. I want to get this sorted first. Orders, manual, select. Lock in with these. Connect that. Release the handbrake. We're going to reverse out. we clear this then we can send him straight forward and it should go straight back to Connolly L2 and he'll stop for the end of the track uh, yes it does you can pop back into first person view the two cameras are separate so this guy is actually uh, my my dude is actually up in Bryson at the moment so you can have the two separate and then you can control T to bring him wherever you want. And uh, there he is. But yes, you just full controls in the... Oh, I better stop him, by the way. 
This full controls in the trains as well. Uh, so we're going here, road, forward. You can go 30 if you can, but uh, you can't, so it's fine. The track limits them. And then we're going to go back here. Yeah, but yeah, it does have first person, but I'm just messing around in third because I like it. You can have multiple trains, you have your own little business. So we're going to do freight and passenger at the moment, so... Passengers, we're going to go Bella and Bryson. thinking is I'll probably just drop that off in Whittier. Drop that off in Ella and take these two up to Bryson. We'll probably, we could probably put that away in Ella. But um, we'll have this guy come back and do the Whittier one. It's going to take us a little while to get to Bryson. On your way, so we'll switch this back over. So the last run we did up this line was to uh, the place he's going, and uh, he'll automatically stop for the end of the tracks. So that's fine. And we'll be doing some shenanigans here. Like there's certain things you can only do in first person mode, like um, re-railing a train. I had been doing all the cars and stuff in first person mode, I'll probably go back to doing that as well. But I was messing around with doing it in um, third person. Oh, um, I want to go on to that line. Train of Consequences, that's not actually a song? Probably. We're going to stop here. I'm just going to drop off. Let's just double check now. Yeah, that's going in there. So that one coming out? Not yet. The second one is going in there. So we're going to just quickly do this. I'll do it in first person later on. We're going to uncouple, go forward. Pop that one here. So we'll throw on the handbrake. Sorry, 
move forward. We'll go pick up everything and then we'll pick up our passengers. 52 passengers waiting. 25 and 27. We can hold 60. Hmm. So we'll pop back here. When the other guy brings the logs down, then we'll just get him to pop over here and uh, put that in there. Just because he'll have something to do then. Alright, so the train brake takes a little while to release. It's handy for slowing down an extra little bit when you're after releasing it. I'm going to hit it hard enough to engage anyway. And then we'll apply that. This one is being dropped off in Ella. Which probably means we'll drop this off get in behind these two. Not sure where that one goes. I know where the Appalachian hardware uh, hardwood goes. We probably have stuff to bring back as well. So he's taking on passengers, grand, and our other dude, oh, has arrived. Excellent. Look at that for timing. I don't need that there because he'll do the same thing for the end of the track. And then you can see the second they touch it, they're counted as in. So that's great. So. I think I'm just going to leave him there. Because we skipped an hour and it fully loaded everything earlier. So I think we can just do our stuff with the other train and then come back. We'll do a little bit with the other train and come back. And uh, you're fully loaded. Yes. All right, off to Ella. We'll do by doing this. Because we're guaranteed he won't screw it up. If they bring in experience for your crews and stuff, and then um, there's a chance that they could crash it, that'd be interesting. Uh, we'll set that here. That's a fusey, as they call it. Um, so your AI engineers that you set on a path will stop for one of them. Usually stop a little bit before it. So the passenger car, I'm hoping, will stop there and then start unloading. 
all of the passengers. So if I wait, um, we know that waiting an hour doesn't remove the trains. Oh yeah, look at that. I, I could just wait an hour and have this fully loaded and get him to go back then. Uh, that's the wrong window. This one, settings, wait one hour. Boom, fully loaded. Um, orders, reverse. So he'll start moving now. And our other dude is still on his way, so that's fine. Uh, control T to here. We need to sort this out. So this will stop him. We'll sort that out. And then he's gonna uh, DFR three stop because the line is switched against us. That's right. That, that's the only thing is these signals that they come up against. We'll stop them. If you haven't got them switched back. Right. So you're gonna come down that way. Yeah, that's fine. Could all be fine because we just came out of here. That's straight there. So I'm going to set the fusey there. Give them loads of room. Normal, normal, normal. So I'll bring them just up to that. Yeah, basically uh, you sit your guy in there in first person. All your controls are there for this train. Sure they'll be different for the other trains. Which there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Eighteen trains in the game. Two diesel, the rest are steam. You can see the moon down there. The sky box is uh, a big sphere. Nice. Yeah, he's making his way down. Preferably safely down the hill. Where we had an issue before when I was driving. Grand. We'll get this done. If we get this done, we can get him move the oil tanker, and then we can get him to go back and finish his repairs. Switch back. Filled our coal and water, so they should be good for a little while. Uh, 
I will actually um, jump up to Bryson. Let's have a look. You two are okay. Uh, we didn't drop anything else down there. I believe that all these buildings are kind of placeholder for the moment. I believe. I don't know. What about you? Oh, you're going to be there a little while. And you guys... 2.8 tons left in that and 25 tons left in that. So we're not going to have to bring anything back, which is actually kind of nice. And let's see how close to Ella we get. The station right there. 35 passengers waiting. Pretty good. Fusing in the gauge, yep. So he's unloading passengers. And then ER1. Oh, you're going in there. Okay. And you guys have 15 tons and 30 tons. people going to Whittier we'll get, grab them on the way back if we can. 33 going to Bryson. We still have 27 unloading. Oh never mind. They're all unloaded. I guess we wait for everyone to load then. Can only load a certain amount of people. Do I drop that here now? Yeah, I do, don't I? We'll drop it on this inside track. Drop it just here. Um, and then we'll pop back around to the back of these. So, handbrake on. And we'll put your handbrake on as well. Our other train is back down now because he stopped for a fusey. We're going to them off. So we'll bring him up here, reverse back down the back of these two cars so the Appalachian lumber will be easier to drop from the front and then you I'll have to have a look at but we can just dump you somewhere and then get you on the way back
slow down a little bit. Attach up to these two, then we'll send this guy as an AI engineer. Up to uh Bryson. So we get him back on the main line. Do that and it's this one. Hell down here by the pips. So we'll reverse. get you stopped and we'll give you the orders then road forward 30 uh 35 or 40 if you can. i think the track is maybe 30 anyway and then you can stop at the station actually right, so he has two cars in front of him We we'll can't stop there. So he's going to run from Ella all the way up. Nothing in the way. Uh, let's just double check back here that the signals are not going to stop him. Even if he gets to a signal here, it's fine. It doesn't really matter. But uh, no, that'll bring him right up to the station. So he's fine. Go back down now. Our buddy with the logs is here. Did he clear it? He did. Switch that. I'll we'll select control of him. Oh, and turn off the orders. And our uh, first person dude is still standing here. Do you know what? I can actually just give him the order of forward. He'll just do it automatically. Which is really nice. So, I haven't used the caboose yet. I don't know what it's used for in this game. Um, I might attach it to this guy just to have it. I haven't looked into it. So he's going to drop these here. Then we're going to take him over to Whittier. Drop him in the oil. Get that all done and dusted. I think that's all he's needed for today then. We can get him repaired. And break on. Connect all of that. Uh, orders, yard, reverse, pointy car lengths. And I want to save up and get a third uh, locomotive. And have it operate out of Bryson just to move things around. These guys can run the trailers up and back and then have another one. Probably use unit three to actually move things around up in Bryson. All right, switch that back over to normal, pop you into manual mode. 
Alright, put the brakes on. So we're going forward. D17 hauls nicely, I have to say. I really like its pickup. Change this switch. Other dude is nearly at Bryson. L little over halfway there. So by the time we do this little job, he'll be sitting at the station. This is what we want. to change this switch, right? Oh, that's good. This one. Do I even need to couple to this? Can I just push it along? Oh, yeah, I had the break on. I had the break on. There we go. Oop. I wonder will that cause damage? Let's find out. Knock into it at over five kilometers an hour, so 4.3 is your speed. Oh wow! Okay, no, it does. It has serious trouble moving it. That's fair enough. Oh, because the air. I didn't bleed the air of the bricks. That's right. Should still count. But that one will want to come out first. But we're not that forward thinking right now. The second you touch that, you're classed as in. There we go. the handbrake. Paid $65. Alright, get him to reverse all the way home. Wait, 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 wait. Flash that, we do have another thing to do here. You've 15 tons left. that and that's all hooked up you guys are connected you are 
And then we're going over to you. I do like this aspect of it that you don't just um, drop it there and it disappears. That it gets used and has to be moved out of the way. Uh, where's the simplest place to put this? EFR 3 stopped for a fusey. Excellent. Probably here, right? Oh, actually, no. up to there. That's what we're going to do. Yeah, we'll reverse it up to here. Pull this one out. Reverse up, connect. Pull back forward and drop the other one in. Is the other one actually unloading passengers? Yes, yes, it is. <laughs> All right, we'll reverse that. Uh, we'll uncouple this. Couple onto that, go forward. We'll link in with this and then pop this back in place. And your handbrake is on, so go forward.
All right, we can stop right there. Release that. Get in close enough to do that. What is that noise and what should I be doing about it? But we have the uh, fuses marked on the interchange already. So we just need to make sure that you're going back there. That's fine. That's fine. All that should be fine. Because you came that way. Going off onto this track. All the way back here. We get rid of this fusey. We're going straight. And then we're going to put you on to this one. So, road, reverse, 30. That's fine. And then he should just pop back there. Uh, go up here. You have released your passengers. So we can do this. And say, we're heading back to Ella and Whittier. You have 78 passengers, so we have 60 spaces for them. Not the handbrake. We'll decouple. And we'll select control this one. Turn off the orders. So Bryson team BR1, where are you going? That way. Wait, where? Wait. Locations. Bryson team BR1. <laughs> of course, it's the one right behind us. Of course, it's that one. So we could have let in with this one. Um, okay, well, I guess we'll move the passenger car. Hopefully that won't uh, screw things up with the loading too badly. Actually, no, it's fully loaded, so that's fine. We'll just reattach this then. Or two stop for a fusey and we get paid. Excellent. Uh, what we can do then is take him out from behind that trailer and put him in for repairs. Keep that going. Which we'll do once we stop here. We'll go orders, road, forward, and he should just stop at the end of that. Stop for the end of that, and then you, we pop, handbrake on. 
disconnect that. Your orders are aired. Move forward 20 spaces. And we'll come back to you in a minute. You're stopping for the end of the track. We'll let him do that. By the handbrake. Decouple that. You're going to reverse 10 spaces. Why have you not moved? Because I have you in reverse. Stop. Go. Huh. What's up with him? CFR2, which is you. There we go. Experience of 20. Okay, now he's moving. Then, for yourself, we're going to the Appalachian Hardwood. Your orders. Forward. And we'll get rid of the fusey. Actually, put that on normal. Keep them going this way. That's on normal. You put this one on normal. And everything else should be set up. Get him up to here. And I'm just going to stop him there. up a little bit so actually I want that window back on manual actually select control of you and uh, he's done his work for the day of his coal. Him back in and get him repaired up. Go. He's set there. So repairs should start up on him now. And then you are already nearly here. Right, you are going. Oh, you're going onto the inside one. Okay. Go onto that one. Good. 
least a handbrake on that. Let's just, um... Release the air out of the brakes, too. slowing down because of this one. It's marked down here. It is perfectly fine, but I'm just going to take manual control now. push this because the second this hits well that's technically in but we'll push it a little bit anyway there we go and break that um we'll hand break that too we won't attach them though Reverse at 35. And we'll send him all the way back to Ella. Uh, which will be fine. And he'll do that because he has nothing in the way. And he has the, the passenger train at the back. So if we pop a player here. He's just going to make his whole way down here. Stop automatically, unload passengers. That'll do nicely. And like our second guy is basically done for the day. Um, so we made 837 yesterday. I, would, I don't know if we're going to make that today. Oh, I need to do, that's right. I need to do that. Which we can do. We can drop the passenger car here and then move that in here while they're unloading. So that's fine. We don't need to bring anything with us. speed up the time multiplier so that it goes through the day more but I'm presuming then later on in the game you're just gonna want that extra time
double check. Yeah, you don't you have nothing. You're gonna be there for a while. Then uh, over by the sawmill. You're all still unloading. But what we could do is pass an hour, which would use some more of this and probably uh, like use more of this and so on. So if say like if we go in here, not gonna move our trains or anything. But if you come back to here, wait one hour, start using up the resources so you can push the resources along it's interesting like if you want to you know go to the end of the day and have maybe some of these to pick up on your way back well, they're not going to be picked up anyway fly all the way over to Ella Pop that in. Leave 13 and a half tons of farming supplies left. This is the first little bridge we built then. Open up Bryson for us. Which is cool and all, but then I kind of want to get money together. I know the Bryson jobs offer more, but uh, what I was thinking is to do more of the local stuff. Which I, I only took this morning on this day so we'll find out what they want done uh, later on that expires today so that's all right I don't think we're getting the timely delivery bonus on that though.
Coming back into Ella. Get these passengers unloaded. All of the passengers unloaded. Then we'll pop that container into the bay. Did you roll enough to clear that? Yes, you did. Stop. All right, passengers are unloading. Apply the handbrake. Should load any passengers that want to go back to it here. If there are any. Nobody from Bryson wanted to come over. Bonk. Right. Release that. Uh, we need to move forward a little bit. finished. Switched over that. It will allow us just to pop this in. tons of miscellaneous and it's already in the space but we'll drop it in a little bit deeper Alrighty, we have 18 passengers going back to Whittier.
Take that, place the handbrake, and we're off. Uh, we'll go like this, 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 this. I'm gonna say 35, we're gonna get rid of... Yep. So he could be on his way. Jump over to Whittier. Um, oh, which track are we coming in on? We're going to come in on the main line. I'm going to set the fusey, I think, here. And that would be that. And then throw that back then just so it doesn't interfere with anything. Will be the day that done. How much stuff was in that trailer at the start? Too far out. What are you doing? 79%. Oh god. Okay. So hopefully we're roughly around 90 by the time we get to tomorrow. extra eighteen dollars we got at the moment we got six thousand three hundred at the moment we can actually buy another one of these we could buy another T seventeen as well or P eighteen Pacific. Do we sell the mogul? Sell this and get a P18. I think we do. Do we have to like? Oh, it just goes to the interchange and sells there. Okay. 
Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. We're going to sell this and get the P-18 Pacific. Just go up the tiers. We're stopping for the fusey. We have 18 passengers to unload. So that'll be doing that and we'll make sure then that so coming in on this line should be just going all the way down to here and then not turning off into that but he is going to turn off into that and then stop for that fusey so everyone's off we can get rid of that fusey and he'll continue his order then reverse doesn't realize the final run Presuming we don't get the money until the next day, so we will sell this today. And if we don't get the Pacific, that's fine. We'll just do all the jobs with the T17. There's our dude standing in the grass. If anyone isn't here earlier, just set up these fusies on these tracks, basically, so that we could just have the guy come back down and drop off whatever we need dropped off. It's worked out really well. Pop them into the interchange. If 
Wait, what? then so let's see what we uh, did for the day yeah you're at 79 percent whoa, whoa what did i do there okay and settings sleep oh we made 1700 there Okay. Is that total? Is that total? So we need to bring you. You're going to Whitlear, you're going to Ella, you're all going to Bryson. Not that bad. Then what about over here? You guys need to go over to the interchange. Yes, you do. And then you guys need to go over Connolly, which is not too bad. There's probably a bunch of stuff that needs to be collected in other areas. E17 is back to full. And then before we do anything, let's purchase that. Yeah, we ordered a shiny new tr Oh, it's already here. Well then, that's even better. I didn't think that would get delivered straight away. So you could probably just take everything up to Bryson. Yeah, you can do the same thing we did uh, the other day, uh, yesterday, and hook up to everything. We'll drop that off on the sidetrack in Whittier. We'll drop that off on the sidetrack in Ella. And then we'll push everything up to uh, the other place. Then you're going to come out there. Sorry, we'll start with you. So glad you're back to 100%. That's against you, yep, that's fair enough. So you move forward, and then we'll manually move you forward. to here that have a handbrake on. It's fine. And then we're gonna switch this. And we're gonna set you orders road forward go. We need to switch this. a bit of a sound bug on that one. I 
be a little bit of a sound bug in that one. Right, we're going to select you, manual. Speed pretty quick, which is nice. Um, oh, you. I'm gonna have Pacific stop pretty soon ish. We're gonna stop here in a second, too. And then your orders are going to be forward. Let's speed. And all we really had to do was switch this, because he's going to go up to Connolly again. And then the Pacific. Um, right, we're dropping you off. You're going in there? Yeah, of course you are. And you're coming out. So again, we're going to pop it into like this line here. And then when the other guy comes back from Connolly, we'll uh, use him to do stuff. Let's see how you get on now with your audio. <laughs> Second stage is um, a bit of a bug. It's unfortunate. A bit of a glitch. Okay, you're being popped in here. We could actually just drop you straight in, mate. Well, no, we can't because we have four cars behind you. We'll start something out there. The other train. Cool. Um, to the reverser and stuff. So now we can set your road forward 30, uh, we can set you to 40, it doesn't matter because he won't go over the, the safe limits. That's fine, you tip on. And um, just want to double check. Okay, you're gonna stay on the main line. And I didn't bring the passenger car. Whoops. Maybe we just bring it with the other one. Oh, that has to go back to interchange as well. Okay, yeah. Hmm. 
Okay. Um, we want them to stop here regardless. That's fine. got the power. along at 34 miles an hour good look at that machine That's what I wanted to check. How much does this hold? Six tons and three and a half thousand gallons. Nice. And we could actually buy back the mogul as well to have it. I'm not going to run three trains right now. T21 is 8,000. A bit of sway. You're near Ella and you are nearing there. Awesome. Like we said before, we'll get this guy back down. So he went second, didn't he? I think he did. But we'll set a busy there. Load the room. It's fine. He did go second, didn't he? Yeah. So we can just set him to come back then whenever. We we just pass an hour and have him loaded, it's fine. set up. I'm going to get rid of the fusey. Switch him back over to manual. And honestly, I'm just going to let him break as he is. This one is being dropped off here. We're going to play out that one first. So... For the moment, we'll drop this off. Vice Bryson team is right next to the the, the uh, railway station, so we have to remember that. I 
Failed handbrake. Oh, that was weird. There we go. That was weird. It's air locked. Is that how they're doing like slip now or something? Seems a bit odd. Seems to be a point there where it messes up the audio, it catches between two clips or something. Uh, we'll follow this guy and we'll pass an hour. I hit the right button. Boom, look at that. Operations. Uh, yep, yeah, this is the right one. Reverse. Off you go. You're on your way over here. But yeah, you're dropping into there, aren't you? Oh, that's empty, so that's going back. Nice. Uh, is the only one coming back? Maybe. We have to bring that out. Or put in the other one. So we'll set the fusey here. So when we get back down, when we get back down, we're going to move these two over to the interchange. The we'll move those two over to the interchange. Do I run? Do I run this train up and collect everything that needs to come back to the interchange? Not really worth it, is it? We'll just mess around with the other one, I guess.
Right, nearly there. So we'll be setting it so that we go in here first. Grab this. Uh, pull it up onto this line. Then we'll be coming back to drop in our second car in here. And we'll look at where the others are going and plan something. Not too far away, though. So all that we've done. Over what? What is it now? It's five hours. Over 13 hours of gameplay. That's as far as we've covered maximum and we haven't done half the stuff in it. And then there's like all that that way. And then there's all this this way. There's a good bit to it. Also faster rails, right? I'm probably wrong on that, but are there faster rails? Or is top speed like around 35 regardless on the main line the whole way? How are you doing? You're nearly back. Excellent. What are you arriving about the same time? Lovely. Let's see it in the distance. Okay. Put you back into manual orders. The fuse in the gauge. Yes, there it is. You're coming out of there. And then, oh, you're going into there. Oh, really? Oh, well, let's do that first then. Get that out of the way, and then we can pop. In what we need to you'll bring us over to that yeah, that's fine let me switch you back, pull out that first tra uh, car, and 
what I might do is pull out that car with the locomotive itself and then attach to the back of the other ones that were already sorted there. If I'd known that, I would have obviously come in that way. Okay. Find the is 2020. Then we're popping down this way. And then we're staying, staying, staying. Good. Go past this signal and then back in there. At this stage, I could just set this. Oh, so like that. And I could do the road forward. stop Lovely. Nice. Locomotive to this and then connect back to the end of this train. Right, once we get back to here, we'll jump over to our other locomotive. Once this thing gets going, it's just gone. That's nice.
I could have the other dude run the passenger car as well. So I forgot to bring it up. Could have put it on the back of this. Heck of a switching yard there. Oh, yeah. This is only the first real one that we've come across. Apply the handbrake. Disconnect. Get her spinning. So much power for what she's doing. We will top off the water. Definitely top off the water. Is the Pacific, it's, isn't that one of the um, more notable names, locomotives? Or am I completely wrong on that? I turned on the bricks. Slow down, lock in. Use that handbrake, reverse up again. Because this one is going in here. And then I'll actually remember to switch over to the other one and get him doing something. this in it's $61 then we'll pop back down to our other guy who's hopefully just sitting there here he is yep put that load in for a sec Reverse you, orders are forward. And uh, that's all he needs to do right now, because he's going to leave them in there first. So I didn't really need to change the selection there. Pop back here now. And we have three, yep, that's fine. So, we're going 
going up to Appalachian Hardwoods. And we're going to do something similar with you. Need to go up here, set this to carry on straight. Uh, this should all be set. Same here and there. And then we stick a fusey here. Go to orders, road forward, go whatever speed you like because you'll go safely. The back one here has to be brought out. And then the other two can pop in there, but we should probably put them in at the back. Should. Probably won't. Off the brake. Oh, okay, we're on orders. Off the brakes. Reverse. This thing just goes from the get go. Like, the Pacific is a little bit slower to start up with the T17. Which goes. We'll just pop these into the interchange, get them done. Then we'll head up to Whittier and do the little um, changes there. And then while the other guy is heading to um, Hardwood Station. And uh, we'll pick up the passenger car as well. Ooh, I never topped up your man's water. Well, hope he's doing alright. He stopped at the hardwood station now though, so that's fine. Fizzy. We're going to bring them in onto this line. Up from there. And unfortunately, we're going to have to go back there anyway. Can't really stop them.
You alright there, buddy? I'm taking damage, that's the main thing. Lovely. More money. Straight up to 28 miles an hour. Nice. I don't want to be going 28 miles an hour in the air, though. Tell me I did it again. We set that and then we set that. I think I'll just always keep the passenger car connected to the T seventeen. that go forward uh we'll go orders road forward forward at 25 we'll switch this back over it'll be over here by the time we get there switch that back over and then that needs to come out. That needs to go in. So set a fusey right there for the moment. And then we'll go back over to Bryson. Oh, no, you're not in Bryson, you're over here. Five hundred gallons of water. Yeah, you'll be alright. So turn on tab. You're going into that one. You're going into that one. So we go normal. That annual. Uh,
that there. I'm gonna take you off. to grab this, attach this one to this one, well actually we're going to attach that one to all of them. Then we're going to pop this one in, pop this one on the outside, so we can grab it easy next time. And then we'll probably just chuck this one into the other side. Oh, it has to go into a different one anyway, so yeah. these. Make these two up. We're good to have a break. Bonk them. the handbrake we're gonna reverse up Plenty of water, I just don't want to go crazy right there. It is trains, we're not in exactly um, a huge rush. Right. Speaking as a train nerd, this game looks incredibly promising. What's your opinion on love? Uh, I'm loving it so far. But even for like a casual train enjoyer like me, it's really good. I'm liking the. Um, what I'm saying is a mix of SnowRunner and uh, T-Rail Valley kind of thing. Because you can have multiple trains. Like you two run a business and you can have multiple locomotives running around. Which is awesome. And uh, yeah, I think it's really good, and I'm um, looking forward to see where they go with it. All right, we got paid seventy six dollars for that. Also, I presume there's going to be mods in the future because it would be 
terrible if they didn't without modding in the future. But yeah, they, they haven't put in like a bunch of bunch of mechanics still not in the game that they plan to put in, you know, like uh, wheel slip and so on. It's early access, but it's very, very promising early access if you like trains. Um, I don't know, because this is, this, what is it, 150 odd kilometers of track? And everything is going to get more complicated, obviously, as you go further and like, this is literally all I've done. And I've only done the basic job so far. Um, is that what I wanted to do? It is. So we want to go forward and drop this here. Yeah, like the same with any game that isn't, you know, um, a lot of people play this are going to want to make their own maps, not that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But it, that, what I'm saying is that that wouldn't hurt the game either. Yeah. Modding never hurts a game. They're, they're, they seem to be pretty active uh, developers. Like I know they have um, time jobs outside of the game dev thing, but they seem to be pretty active. So we're gonna unhook that one, and then we're also gonna unhook this one. that we can pop this one in here and then we bring these two back with us and what we'll end up doing then is setting a fusey for this guy I believe in Ella so he can make his way down there Although, actually, we'll probably get him for water and stuff first. Got your mood up a fair bit. The crazy frog is back. You're delirious now. Clearly delirious. Just let out a remix of Last Christmas. There's two things I never wanted to see together or on their own, to be honest. Um, honestly, yeah, we don't need to put them together either. This one is probably going to want to come out beforehand. Yeah, I just turned on the brake. Ah. But it kind of works. No. No, no, it doesn't. Alright, let's get rid of that. We want to go down here. We want him stopping, I guess, here, right? Uh, well, here. Stay right here. Hit the right button. There we go. 
So we want him stopping there, so we change that. And then we go out here. That's correct. That is correct. That's correct. And then I want to change that one. I'm going to see if we can sleep something. Do. Do, boy. All right, hopefully he doesn't crash. So you're here and we bring you out. So orders, manual, uh, select that, make sure we're not doing anything to the other one. Sure there's no air in the brakes and all that we're going to push it forward a little bit if we have to um you know if i put this guy on the right track Stop for a fusey, excellent. And we still have to do the passengers. Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay, because I opened that. Perfect. So, we're going to pull back. Um, put out this one, pull it back onto that track, put in this one. Back out, connect to that one. Sure, yeah, it's delivered. <laughs> Technically. Is that a thing now with the game that if 
That's technically delivered. I can just run away with that now. Even though it would do me no good. didn't shift click so these are still open there it is make sure they're closed that there and hopefully remember it. So we set him up to go and he's going to go all the way up to Ella. Set a thing here. Oh God, didn't it passengers? Oh, at this stage, keep going. And we'll reverse back that way. While he's doing that, we can... Um up the other guy to um, do his refueling and stuff. So, just getting past the junction. Orders, road, reverse. We'll come to a stop and do that and go back to Whittier people, hopefully. And then there was you. Uh, you're going to switch that way and then you're going to switch that way. Orders, manual, forward. We won't crash into it.
Alright, we'll top up our coal first. I can carry it with, I think it's six tons, isn't it? Yeah, at the Pacific, six tons, so he's going to be there for a minute. So we'll go back to Whittier. Get the daily uh, passengers loaded. There we go. Is he in the gauge? Yes, there is. So he's going to load up with all the passengers. They're all going to Bryson, except for those ones. Okay. Leave that fusey there. The next thing, then we just give him the fusey or the fusey, the order then to uh, go forward when it's loaded. Hmm. Just done. All right, we'll move forward for the water. Open the hatch. Just realized might be missing two cars, am I? <laughs> okay. Well, we'll go back for them in a minute. that I can left them behind oh my god three all loaded forward get on output Fusey here. Uh, no. Here, right? Right there. That'll be that, and then we go over to 102. Get your water. And <laughs> we're going to uh, reverse back out on this line. And then I head back and get the containers. A little bit of an audio glitch, but not, not too bad. He'll head back to that fusey, and then we just set him to go forward. And he'll go until he meets the cars. And just make sure he's facing the right cars when he gets there. Coming down here and then going, nope, not going straight there, going straight there. Pick up these two, right? Yep, these two. Let's go back to East Whittier. Okay. 
the meantime, he's halfway to Ella. And then, what does he have to do when he gets to Ella? Didn't we drop something there? Yeah, we did. Yeah, you need to come out. And you need to go in. So we'll pull that out. And... Um, <laughs> Connect to that, pop it in, and then pull back and get the passengers. We'll probably leave this here. Yeah, I'll leave that here for the other one to collect. So then he can continue on with the passengers. I believe how I'm going to do that. Manual control. Keep forgetting how good those brakes are. wrong with you you're not connected oh no you're not gonna yeah i don't want you connected Open that and turn off the handbrake there and you're going to reverse whatever speed you like then we're going to make sure that he's on the main line here R2 is in Ella because he's stopped for the fusey. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. And I don't have a fusey or anything here. Fine. So he's going to pass straight through and go on to Ella as well while we're doing our other stuff there. Follow this. Um just gonna release that orders manual off the brakes Yeah, we'll connect to this. Good. And we need to go forward a bit, as ever. That's fine. So the other dude is going to come down to there. Stop before the fusey. So that'll be fine.
60 passengers on board, good. Uh, no, that's the wrong one. I didn't need to go back that far. I need to do this. Actually, no, I want that going this way. Don't mind me, I'm two mines. Gonna grab this one. Yeah, because he's like a, either, well, a third of the way here. Apply that. Disconnect that. this in. That one is going to be done soon. That's good. The other one is nearly here. That's grand. Did I leave enough room for the locomotive there? We'll find out in a second. Probably not. Thank <laughs> you. 
Let's reverse. up and hook up to the passenger train we're gonna have to reverse a little bit further do and we'll get rid of that it'll stop before the train so that's fine Is that enough yeah it's plenty here he comes Okay, yeah, he's going to stop because the switch is against him. That's perfect. Well, we can do that. <laughs> Make him stop in front of the train. Manual mode. And we're going to move forward. Make that normal, and then we're gonna train brake, slow down a little bit. Then we're gonna tell you orders road forward 35 if you want. Hook up these. The handbrake. And then we're going to tell you reverse at whatever hell speed you want. And you're going to go all the way to Ella. So we get rid of this. Oh, no, we don't. No, we don't. We put a fusey. We don't even need to put a fusey there. We bring him in on this track. That's that. And then. Bring you in that track. So the 102 is going to come down and meet up with that car. 
Oh, do I want them connected on that side though? No. We'll just bring them through. Connect from the other side. We'll put a fusey. We'll get rid of this fusey. Put one here. Get rid of the one at the station here. So he should be fine. And then our other bio. He popping into here and then stopping right there. After all that, be all the jobs done. Going around that 30 limit and then it'll be back up to 35. And you're tipping along at 34.6. And then we select the other two stations to do return voyage. Dropping off 60 people up here, and then we'll do a return voyage. make a decent bit of money then today. We made 1700 yesterday. Or is that total? I don't know. Let's uh, see if it's in here. Oh, payment from the Whittier Sawmill for delivery of 24 dollars 1300 So that is for the day. Okay. Fair enough. Right, so he's stopping for the fusy here. So probably stop short of where I want him. So pop into manual mode. Very rare that I run with cargo behind me, <laughs> which is an issue. Um, yeah, so you should actually be like 
Oh, are you in a position that I... Oh, that's that's going to be interesting. Okay. We're going to be able to connect to that. Hopefully it'll let us. Brown bricks. See what happens here. Right on that junction. Oh. Oh, you fecker. Okay. Okay. Hoping to avoid that, but hope. Okay. Due to that station, that's good. All right, we have to go all the way up. Top speed forward for you. And we'll go over here and see that he's doing this correctly. Could be. Yeah. And you have 66 passengers waiting to go back. So that's fine. And 6 to Ella and 60 to Whittier. So you're probably going to load the 6 for Ella first. So we put a fuser there. Then we'll tell him to turn around when we need to. Excellent. DFR one oh two at reverse please. And then we did set it up already, but yeah, going this way. And then Going that way. Cool. Have that sound bug that I'm not going to go near. Seems to have passed it now. Um, I need to look over and see if we actually loaded everyone. 960. There we go. Orders reverse. Whatever speed you can. No, oh, he'll stop at Ella. That'll be our passengers' stuff done, pretty much. Yeah, because we'll get um, him to stop at Whittier on the way back as well.
Reverse, road, reverse, whatever speed you like. Switch is against you. No, it's not. We'll let him come down and he will be going all the way down here. He might as well. Well, he has to go straight, doesn't he? Yeah. You go straight in there, stop with that fusey, we'll drop the trailers, we'll pull them back. He'll have to come up around the front and I'll drop in the, the other one, it'll be fine. We'll be waiting for the passenger train to do its thing anyway. So that will be behind. The passenger train then is on the way to Ella. This guy's already here, so. Cool. But if we really wanted to, we could pass an hour and get those logs used. Yeah, he's a really short uh, stopping distance compared to the others. Nice. We get paid for all of them, of course. Go manual, turn off the brakes, going to reverse. just flies along. It's great. Turning up that way, perfect. Probably slow down before we get to that. I don't know about going through one of them at 36 miles an hour. Stop, going to reverse.
How's the other guy doing? He's coming into Ella. Sweet. And you're technically in the interchange, so that's fine. It's the last of the things we're bringing in. It will be disappearing anyway. Let's get you out of the interchange. for a switch lined against us. Oh. Oh yeah. That is correct. That's all right. Let everything load in. A lot of passengers waiting here now. We could probably do a two car run. <laughs> and our guy just standing there. Six people getting off here, and then we'll get any extra people for quit here. Yeah. Okay, we're full. Get on out of here. And then you'll be going over to wait here. You'll be staying on the main line. And you'll be stopping right there. Let's see how much money we make. We'll just keep the passenger car attached to this guy. So we don't forget it. Passenger car.
Maybe, maybe I'll put the passenger car on the Pacific and then use the Pacific to do the Bryson run. Just drag all the trailers up there. Have another train in Bryson. And then the Pacific can come back and do the passenger run as it's going. Then the T-17 does the, the log run and then whatever bits need to be dropped here and in LA. Maybe. Because getting this done earlier would be handy, wouldn't it? The last two days we've been just waiting for this train to end the day. Waiting an hour to speed this up. Another take the time. So after that, then set up. And then you want to go to Connolly's. That's fair enough. So with you, let me move you forward a bit more. you in here. All right, we just got paid. Lovely. Another $114. Get rid of that, and he should be on his way back to the yard. Then I need to set up where I want him to go. Straight on there. He's going to pop in here where we always go. Sorry for that deafening noise when we switch over. Right, so what's our balance at the moment? 6-3. Can we get the eight one? I wonder can we get the eight one and we get the other train or locomotive?
already. Let's end the day. Cool. Waiting for those to change. Oh, what we made three hundred oh equipment. And change received three cars. Is that all? But equipment minus nineteen hundred. Now I'm just confused. <laughs> um, where are you going? Denzel, Ella, Bella. Handy little run. And then we can do the logs. I guess we could take that contract again. Oh, yeah, loads to not set. So yeah, okay, I get that now. Once we take the contract, we can bring the the loaded ones to here. That's fair enough. Okay, right, guys, I'm gonna call it there. Appreciate people hanging out. Hope you're having a good one, and uh, hope we'll catch you again soon. We went for about seven hours. <laughs>